I'm a huge fan of Bob Marley, you know, because his music is genius and just became the voice of such a powerful message and, and fearless uh, about bringing his message forward. We came to this world to fight for love and justice while filling our souls with the most infectious rhythm that brings joy to our hearts. You could not even hear the lyrics. And even musically speaking, it reaches you like in a place that's so peaceful and like is calming, I think. And I think the human race needs that. I mean, Bob's music, it's like medicine. Bob's music and message were so aligned with who he was as a human. One of the most legendary people that ever lived this earth. He's on the playlist for the good vibes that his music brings. You know these songs. You know what they've meant to our culture. You've got an identifiable genre that's so closely related to one person. And when you think of reggae music, you think of Bob Marley. Bob Marley revolutionized reggae music. His music transcended race. Bob Marley is like a universal artist. Like Bob Marley jams are bumped in fraternities on the East Coast and at festivals in South Korea uh, and in shanty towns in Nairobi. Like that music is felt everywhere. He is a legend and he is unforgettable. Only one Bob Marley. His songs will live on forever. They're like new age hymns. They're spirituals for a new contemporary age. And when you hear them, your life has changed. You know, he sang with conviction about what mattered to him. And it takes courage to do that. I mean, he did it to a point that almost got him killed. And so, to me, Bob represents courage and the creative spirit. I think Bob as a writer is very inspiring and in how he was able to put real world problems into his music in such a grand way that we could all relate to. His energy and his presence changed the world really for the better. Bomali music makes me feel happy. It's a very powerful messages that touch my heart. His music always has a message and I think that he's a timeless, iconic artist. One of the greatest songwriters, no matter what genre. I'm from East Africa, and like in East Africa, like Bob Marley is just like a sensation, even to this day. Actually, early on, when we were starting, Pete and I didn't really agree on a lot of things musically, but we agreed on Bob Marley. Totally. Bob Marley represents Jamaica and his culture. We went to see Bob Marley at Madison Square Garden. I had never experienced a vibe like I experienced that night. Thank you, thank you, Bob Marley. Your vibe will live forever. When he's talking about really serious stuff, there's always that underlying message of, you know, one love and everything's gonna be all right. Put in the message beyond the music, and I believe that that's something Bob Marley brought to the game. He really dedicated himself to what he was doing. Because as my grandfather said, this music will keep growing until it reaches and finds the right people it's meant for. You could really feel his soul in the music. It inspired so many people. But Mali's music and his message is the biggest evidence that we have today that the world could be better. He gave us his soul. He gave us his true, honest opinions and thoughts. And it still is on today in his songs. It's amazing to see the legacy that he has left. People always sing his song all the time. Redemption song. That's one of the first songs I remember learning how to play. Redemption song. The songs of freedom. Great music never dies. Good vibrations never die. And he was all about good vibrations. And the vibrations, they just keep vibing higher and higher. Thank you for your spiritual music that continually nourishes, heals, and inspires. Our deepest love and respect goes out to you always. One love. Every little thing, gonna be alright.